first little hiccup of the day. If I had a GTR, probably look exactly like this. Oh, all right. Top mount. Yeah, this dude really sold it. We got my dream garage right here, just chilling. There he goes. What's up? What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. So, as you guys read by today's title of the video, we are on the way to Nest Fest. Before you guys think, how are you going to Nest Fest? And you're in the Q50, you're not in the Z. I really wanted to bring the Z guys like really bad, but honestly, I didn't think I was gonna come this year. And long story short, I kind of decided last minute to come. And the car is leaking a little bit of ED5 from like the fuel tank area. It's very little. It's, it's very weird too. It's only when I fill up the car. Anyway, it's leaking a little bit and I decided like Thursday, today Sunday, I decided like Thursday that I was going to come. Long story short, I texted my tuner, who also um, is essentially my mechanic, asking if he had time to uh, check out the car. Who is the cop? He pretty much didn't have time until the next day, which was Friday and I was super busy Friday. And yeah, so that, uh, long story short, I, was, I just wasn't able to take it to him. And I mean, hey, that's facts. Um, long story short, I could have brought it, but since the track where the event is hosted is like an hour away from me, I lucky didn't, want, didn't really want to risk it. Um, I probably would have made it there and back to be honest, but um, when it comes to like fuel leaks and stuff, I don't like to risk stuff like that because I mean, obviously, fuel could lead to fire, you know what I mean? So I'm straight on that. So, long story short, I'm bringing the Q50 today. Um, by no means do I think this car is a show car, at the end of the day, this is like my daily driver, my little beater. But I feel like it's nice enough to take it to a show. And besides that, I'm honestly mainly going to get you guys content. Show you guys some pretty clean builds. And yeah, I really am bummed out though. I really wish I was in my Z. But like I said, I just, I waited to the last minute. And I just didn't want to risk anything. So let's go ahead and fast forward to the show. First little hiccup of the day. <laughs> I installed it again yesterday because it was kind of coming off. And this will cause me stop, pull over. <laughs> <laughs> Great. No way, bro. I look at a Finney thing was gonna be dead. There's literally nobody here. And usually at this time it's like the light, I mean the line is all the way to like that light that's like down the street. Check out that GTR though, damn. But what the heck, bro? I had a feeling all the Nissan boys went to Beamers. <laughs> Check out the little frontier on the TEs. It's pretty sick. You shout out to the homie right here, bro. I was driving in, the lady like waved me down. She was like, hey, there's not your diffuser falling off. And I was like, oh, no way. So I pulled over. And the guy was like, hey, you need some 3M tape? I was like, bro, yes, I actually do. So shout out to him. I think I seen him uh, get the tape out of a black Q60, so shout out to you, bro. I guys made it, parked next to this clean gray Q all over me with the carbon fiber bumper. And the, I don't think I've ever seen this. Yet. Pretty sick. Yeah, I'd be scared to drive with this bumper. I'd be scraping everywhere. The design is super sick, though. Besides it being carbon fiber, like the whole like design of it is pretty sick. All right, guys, we're all done. Car's all cleaned up. Let's go check out what's at the show. Got a Z on the VSKFs, I think they're cool. Very nice. Clean G on the Chrome Nismo. And with the 370Z Nismo C, that's hard. Oh, dude, this is one of my favorite colors ever. It's like, I don't know what the exact name of this color is, but like the bluish slash Nardo gray is probably one of my favorite colors. I need to do that on one of my cars one day. Holy Chrome. Which is dope. I like when people go all out on their engine base. Oh, it's got to be the hardest Q60 here so far, at least. Chrome nibbles in the front. The welds in the back. This is so hard, bro. This black Q60s always hit different, too. For sure, my favorite Q60 so far, at least. Super clean. We got this for tripping over here. Looking at the, the intakes. Little subtle flex. Passenger princess. Damn. 
got a Q50 on some Cosmes. I don't think I've ever seen a Q on these wheels. I remember when I first got my Z. Like when I first got it, I really wanted those wheels. It's crazy. No Savo kid? <laughs> the white body. All over me. It's clean. Moves in the front. The VMS is in the rear. You find out. It's just quick. Clean. QQ60 on the Nismo 57s. I feel like I'm seeing these wheels a lot today. Got a Q50 over here on the Nismos. QPTZ Nismos. And a 4 star. Bro, 4G. Thick. If I had a GTR, probably look exactly like this. The Advance. Not not the big spoiler, but damn another Q on a tire. All these fast guys are outside today. The material B blocks. Not gonna lie, Q's look pretty good. Look at that tire in the rear. Should I boost mine? So I can do this? Should I boost mine? This is the part we say no, sell it for your beamer. No, sell it. Got the homie Orlando's Q60 right here. This car's been on the channel quite a few times. Super clean with the T's in the front. And the forged four star bead locks in the rear. She's pretty quick too, bro. I've been seeing him post some races. Oh, that's why he's so quick. Oh, the car, I didn't even notice this. I see you. So this is how you be gapping all the B58s, huh? That's how you be gapping all the B58s? It's a low Q60. Got a RZ34. Should I get one of these guys? I haven't seen that for a while, but. I was talking to the homie right now, that Q60. He was telling me the car he beats full bolts on the 85. I knew the VR30 does have like potential, which is like the little issues that it gives you. But after talking to him, all the cars he be beating, all the power he makes, I'd be down to look to get one of these. A little football tiny if I set up. Gotta be some pretty fast cars. And the best thing about it is that you never really see these. I mean, obviously you're at a car show, there's gonna be a couple here, but you never see these on the shoot. But I don't know, I feel like paying that much money, I think I'd rather get a Supra. I don't know why. Casually got an R34 just chilling right here. My ultimate dream car. If I get one of these, I could die happy. I don't need anything else. I don't need no SVJ, no Ferrari, nothing. Just this. That's it. This is my Z, and I'll die happy. Got the super clean 370Z in this one. On the World S71 B locks. I need these wheels ASAP. This shit is super nice though. Clean up. Sick. Me if I had a 370. Even this one's super clean on the Meisters. I got some 370s. I'll take a white one. Yeah, oh yeah, because your 350 was white. Oh, brother. Oh, oh. I'll sell my right now for this, no cap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, let me find out you be gapping people. Oh, shoot. 37 on the weld street R manual all right this thing is super nice that's actually very sick oh I didn't even notice bro he also has 370 Zenismo seats and red back seats dude this shit is hard 10 out of 10 very nice another Q oh all right top mount on the weld? I need them center caps. Very nice. Let's get that run, my G. <laughs> oh, we got the famous low tech over here. The homie told me that he was selling this car. I don't know if he ended up selling it. So is this the new owner? No way, it is the new owner. What the heck? This who actually sold it? Yeah. Z33 underscore G. That's crazy, bro. The whole yeah, the homie had told me that he was selling it. Yeah. I didn't know he actually sold it. Damn. Crazy. No more low tech Z33. Yeah, this dude really sold it. I don't know. I feel like I'll never be able to sell my car. Never. Just the thought of seeing my car on the street driven by somebody else. <laughs> I can't. Shit, you gotta move on sometime though. Casually got a Camry in the middle of a Nissan show. Take an asshole. We got the big baller over here. 
the Nismo uh, Z, I guess. It's not 400 GT. Nismo Z. I love this color so much. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, Nissan. It just sucks that they're only, they only come in automatics. Oh, it has a Tomei. Is that what you said? Dual Tomei? I didn't know they made dual Tomei for these. Hey, that's looking sick. Let's get some. Let's get some. Another 370Z. Not sure if it's an actual Nismo. On the TEs. Some of your wheels, sir. No way. I'm pulling the bike. What the? No way. On the tire, too? Damn. On the tire. What stock intakes? <laughs> That's fucking cool. GTR. Damn, so he's like, if I can't give you my G, I'll give you my bike, huh? GTR boys. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Next year, let's do it. We gotta make it happen. Literally, bro, we can make it happen. <laughs> yeah, screw all that. I'll get a new Z. I'll get a super. Let's just go for GTR. <laughs> go be here, go home. So the good thing about the show is that besides all the nice cars, there's also like a little group event. And I think you can actually get like a ride along. Did you get a ride along? Let's go. Let's see. Let's put the Q in with no power steering, just oh, crash. Shit. Super clean. 370Z Nismo on the... This is a black chrome, right? That is black chrome. I don't know, bro. After seeing the homies Q60. I just want everything, bro. I want, I'm gonna just shut up because I want everything. This is my spec right here, look. Literally. Right on T's. Damn, if I had one, it would literally look like this. Well, if I do full bolt on and stuff like that, probably a little weld in the back. Yeah. Nah, actually, I'll probably leave it like this again. Super clean. Uh, SVT and the PBSs. Damn, that little wide body has makes it look so nice. These are so clean, bro. Imagine this with the RV. Ah, it's expensive though. Bag 370 with the uh, Meisters. Never disappoints. Super clean. Oh, hell no, nah, bro. I'd be scared for somebody to step on my lid. I put like some cones or something. Bro, check out this key right here. Super clean. Literally my spec again. Red, carbon fiber teeth. Super clean, bro. Got the corridos bumping, damn. Can never go wrong with RPF ones on the queue. What if you miss mine? Got some two black G's. Tell me, bro, I'm seeing these wheels a lot today. But can't blame them. Sheesh. Check out this queue. On the weld. Tell you guys. Queues look so good. With a nice tire on them. Oh, it's a VHR too. Damn all over me. I should boost mine. Titanium intake. Very nice. Very, very nice. I don't want to be thinking about the VR, another VR30. Nah, but to be cute, that's what's up. That's actually pretty nice. I wonder how much power it makes. Made him out. Let's see if you can see the turbo from here. Yeah, made him out. See it right there. You got my dream garage right here, just chilling. Mark IV Supra. R34, GTR, R35. Which one are you guys taking? One, two, or three? I'm taking number two all day. I'll take this over anything, bro. A Bugatti. I'll take it over a Bugatti. This thing looks super good with the, what are the 18 Advance? Medium tire? Oh, I've heard of that shot before. Fast guys for sure. Uh, you just know this car's fast. Yeah, Lambo just chilling. I'll take either of these three over this Lambo. Me personally. I know some of you guys might think I'm crazy, but any of them over that. Seeing all these Z's makes me regret not just full sending it. I could have full sent it and brought it, but I don't know. I feel like it's kind of sketch. Bro, I completely missed this. My boy took his Z to pin my ride. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, this is wild. What do you think about this? My style. Imagine bros like upgraded turbos. <laughs> we gotta record. Can of King Taco. Grab a bite to eat. Back from eating. Let's, 
look at what's in the parking lot, but I don't want to walk, so I'm gonna drive. <laughs> okay. Little, little HR right there. 370? I love uh, like simple HR like that, Lord. On the anniversaries. And I'm really spoiling them intakes. Oh, what the heck? And this one right here? In the middle. Nowhere in the parking lot. This GTR right here. Millennium Jade. T spec? Yeah, but I knew it was T spec. Expensive. Ah, uh, there's so much breeze up here. It feels so good. Sheesh, my cue's right there all by itself. It looks like the cue that was next to me left already. <laughs> Honestly, I'm gonna be leaving soon too. You guys have no idea how good it feels up here, bro. So much breeze. Super clean drift car. I'd be scared of crashing. about getting a ride along because I guess you could do ride alongs for 60 bucks. If he does, I'll have him record with his iPhone and I'll record the outside for you guys. I completely missed his boot R34 right here. Wow bro this thing is probably my favorite car here. Matisse the GCR center car that's it. Wow 2JZ bro hey where's your gas cap? What do you do for a living bro? Are you hiring? Are you adopting? So 60 bucks for a drift taxi and 100 for a pro car. What are you gonna do? Probably the 100. Seriously? Yeah. Baller, my bad. Doing the pro car? <laughs> He's wilding. 100 bucks? Man, I'll take you around the vlog in my queue. Damn. Wilding. I could have taken you behind for less in my queue. <laughs> Same experience. R32. Tell me, bro. Are these the next TVs or something? Because I've seen like. Right on time, bro. Whoa. This is a car that Eric's gonna be riding in. I'm assuming it's a swap. Oh, that's a drift taxi. So they were charging him 60 bucks to ride in this one. And then 100 for this one. Yeah, I good thing you paid 100, okay? Pretty sick. So the girl told us to go back because I got to the two-step and there goes the car. Eric's going to be... Should be you right there. There he goes. 
I just know that was scary right now. Recommend it? <laughs> Real quick before we leave, I completely missed this Z. Pretty clean. I like the little eyelids he did. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like it makes the friend look a little bit better. Yeah, it does make it look better. I wanna get this wing on my personal car, but I feel like it's pretty sick. Alright, that's it for me, guys. I'm going home. That was NISFest 2024 for me. I look he did, kind of regret not bringing the Z, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I kind of wish I would've full sent it, but I feel like everything happens for a reason. I definitely would've been hating it right now, though no AC, it's like almost 100 degrees. We're gonna do it for this video, guys. Hope you guys all enjoyed. If you guys did, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up for me, subscribe if you're new, hit that bell button so you guys can be later whenever I post. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.